Hey guys, this is Monica at Academic Phoenix Plus, and today I'm going to cover how to quickly create curtains using NURBS and then converting them to polygons. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is go to the top view and grab an EP curve tool. And the trick is just to go ahead and just create these S curves so that you're going to create wrinkles for uh, curtains. And then press enter when you're done. We are going to duplicate this curve and then lift, select the two curves, and then we're going to use what's called loft. This is under the surfaces tab and it's called loft. Go ahead and click on that. And right away we have curtains. I'm going to go ahead and select this and go to modify, convert, NURBS to polys, options. Make sure that your control points are selected and then click tessellate. It's going to look very uh, sharp, but that's okay. Just go ahead and press the number three and that's going to smooth it out. And now this is polygons. So you can still have an effect on the object. So for example, I can grab this curve and move it up and down and you can see that I can uh, have some sort of effect. You can also scale to make it look more interesting if you like. And that's basically how you quickly put uh, curtains into your environment. You can also just delete the history, edit, delete by type history and now you're more than welcome to just go ahead and scale and then duplicate them and then just place them in your environment okay guys I hope that was helpful that was a really quick tutorial on how to create curtains very quickly using curbs that produces nerves which you convert into polys don't forget to subscribe to my channel let me know what you think of my tutorials I'd love to hear from you and thank you for all the support I will see you guys next time